Good afternoon, Mr. Nori. My name is Don Isaac Niganor. I'm from grade 12 STEM. And today I'm going to show you my artwork in Sipar. Here's my artwork. Uh, it's just a simple artwork done with uh, circles and squares. Uh, I basically just use rulers and any objects that I can find around me and you know make use of them. Uh, if you are uh, if you want um, a full view of or an image of this artwork I can definitely send you a picture but um, today I'm going to explain it what's the meaning or what's the essence behind this artwork so first I'm going to tell you that this artwork represents life life was introduced as a perfect plane like this um, square that is inside these circles life was introduced as a perfect plane when we were child but life was told by us by the people around us and life is full of unending circles that continuously rotates and explains why emotions in our life we have ups and downs and the gray areas uh, on this artwork represents that it is not happiness nor sadness but the average feeling that we get every time you know that unexplainable feeling that we get uh, every day the strong colors in the middle uh, represents happiness hope joy and harmony how vibrant and how the color sets the mood that is why i concluded it as these emotions light color on the ends represents sorrow melancholy and regret how light is the color placed in the middle of the circle makes them bad um, comparing these colors to clothes you will know that the person is uh, or sad or not into the mood when they are wearing black or you know that the person uh, is uh, happy or their birthday in that day when they are wearing red um, the next thing I want you to notice is how I drew or colored the circles on the plane primary and secondary colors this represents the people in our life the primary colors are your family and the secondary colors are your friends who makes your plane complete or full to make it through everyday circles of our lives that comes to us that is why we should not bottle up every emotions and we have and we should share our thoughts to these people that could help us to be the best version of ourselves um, we can also add in this art that I have used of the negative spacing because of the usage of dark colors that uh, um, removes the spaces between an object to an object and that that is what makes this art piece unique and masterpiece so that's it for my um, art explanation on contemporary Philippine arts from the region um, I hope you learned something from watching this video and God bless have a good one